everybody, it's a Week in Review. Our class in invented a rock version of our hawk song, and we made it so pedal to the metal that I, I've just started jumping and doing funny stuff all the time. Today I'm participating in the uh, Shadow a Student Challenge. So all of our secondary principals across the district are all shadowing students today. I'm shadowing Laney, the seventh grader here at Hillsboro. We're at Heritage Elementary and we're in third grade music class. We're learning how to play open strings. We are learning about maps and gloves. We found United States, um, Africa, Africa, and Mexico. Today in the Black History Month assembly with Mr. Kevin Dyson, he talked about leadership and perseverance and how he came from not very much. Today at Longview, we are celebrating 125th school. In first grade, we are engineering towers to see which one's the tallest. We are rock stars. This is diagnostics, and we are learning how to suture a banana. We did the Winter Olympics at Scales Elementary. We are Miss Kelly's class representing Japan. The, some of the events we did were downhill skiing, luge, and two-man bobsled. We are learning um, about This week in science class, we dissected owl pellets. We matched up the bones to a chart to find out what the owls had eaten. This week in Trinity, our fourth grade class was measuring angles with our protractors. So measuring acute, obtuse, and wide. We're doing uh, a fashion show while we learn about clothing and how to describe what people are wearing. So that is our Pure Creek Heart Challenge. We jump rope to raise money for the American Heart Association. We're doing a STEM challenge and we thought that it would be cool to make these little zip line carriers. Today in science we did a pendulum experiment. We started with a string length of 38 centimeters, put a washer on one end, and then attached the other end to a pencil on a desk. Then we raised the string to 90 degrees and then counted how many full swings there would be in 15 seconds. My Digital Arts Design, design 3 are working on a maker project. The students have the chance to make whatever they want with the laser cutter. Hi, we're celebrating uh, Pirates at Ruston Elementary School. It means that they left glued, but they hit it. What's in your treasure box? Um, we have no idea, but we yeah. think it's gold and um, maybe maybe coins or maybe chocolate coins. This is third grade, getting ready for our Gotta Be Jazz performance. <laughs> This week in art, we're doing Clay Week. In second grade, we're making cat sculptures. Hi, I'm at Nolansville High School in Honors Choir, and we just qualified for the State Festival, and this is why. Not gonna trip, not gonna stumble. No, I'm not gonna slip, no, nothing gonna stumble. Stumble my feet. We basically did a simulation on distributing um, energy, so there was a sunlight group, um, two plant groups, a herbivore group, and a carnivore group. Yesterday, we had a dentist visit our room. Hi, this is Sean McConnell. I'm ABL McConnell's father, and I'm here today at Mill Creek Elementary talking about songwriting during their songwriting series. Mercy, why you gotta show up and look so good just to hurt me? Bonjour, bienvenue à Mardi Gras. Mardi Gras, it's Fat Tuesday. It's a big celebration in Europe and also in New Orleans. Today in PE class we're playing four corner soccer, which is basically a hard game where you have to try to be able to shoot your soccer ball far in the small space. Our Grassland Middle School game day cheer team went to nationals in Orlando, Florida and placed first in the nation. Go Generals! Today in fifth grade art, we are making caricatures. We're doing comics and uh, we're drawing portraits of ourselves, but in common. Today, our prom committee put on a prom fashion show advertising for our school's prom. We showcased latest fashion trends, and we announced our theme for prom this year. At Clovercroft, we're doing a random acts of kindness week, and student council is collecting food for the future. Hi, I'm Olivia. 
I'm in second grade and we are putting stars up for AR tests. Today we've been celebrating the Dr. Seuss Parade by reading a lot of books and we had a big Dr. Seuss Parade. This week at Heritage we are doing high school registration where we pick, pick our classes for freshman year and figure out a four year plan. This is theater production and we are building and moving set pieces for the spring musical Cinderella. In music class we have been learning how to play the ukulele and we've also been playing the line sleeps tonight. <laughs> This week in art, we're using clay to make paintbrush holders. Tonight at Walnut Grove, we are showcasing um, some STEM activities and we have math activities in the cafeteria. And we also are showcasing our learning commons with all the technology in there. This week at Renaissance, students worked on their year-long iLab projects. My group worked on a podcast about meditation and mindfulness. Today we got to vote in a great cookie election and chocolate chip cookies lost 80 to 80. In rehab we learned about the anatomy of the ankle and how to prevent and treat injuries and today that is what we're working on by taping them. This morning Chapman's Retreat had our monthly assembly and Amara won the award for our Habit 6 Synergize Award. I won the award because I am a team player and I listen well to others' ideas. This week at Centennial, we held the Nissan Driver Safety Initiative. So it was basically like a big trivia game. And um, we had like these clicker things and like I had to answer questions. It was a great week. Thanks for watching. Tonight at Skills Elementary, we are having math night. So if I take two numbers and add them together. There's tons of fun games. Fun time at math night. <laughs> we're playing math games and we're having a lot of fun. Doing math. Where you like learn while having fun. <laughs> you're basically playing and you're learning. My favorite game was probably the con playing Connect Four with my sister. So tonight's about the family. So then what is that? You play games with your family and have fun family time. Do you have to do 7 plus 3 plus 9? Yeah. I get to spend time with my family. You're happy and you're playing games, yay? <laughs> yes, that is very fun because she is my mom and she's related to me and I love her a lot. It's fun because my brother's not here and he's not being annoying. You can get scores. My favorite part was probably watching all the robot robots in the learning commons. When you learn something, it's like feels good. It's really smart to put learning with fun. We're playing the Yahtzee game. Your brain gets all worked up for tomorrow. Connect four. Whenever you get four in a row of that color, you win. But I don't really care if I win. And it was really fun to me because you would do different movements. One, 44. Six divided by three is two. Divided by two is four. It was really fun. Love it. I love it. It's my favorite subject. It's really fun and enjoyable. It's really fun. It's just a fun night. Everybody really loves math, and you can tell, and it makes my math heart happy. Go math night!